Prime Minister Fumio Kishida was unhurt after a man threw a cylindrical object believed to be a pipe bomb about 30-40 centimeters long, which exploded ahead of a stump speech he was due to make during his visit to Western Japan on Saturday. Kishida was visiting the Saikazaki port in Wakayama Prefecture to support his ruling party's candidate in a local election. And the explosion occurred just before he was to begin his speech. A young man believed to be a suspect was arrested in the same day at the scene after he allegedly threw the explosive. Although no one was hurt, the chaotic scene was reminiscent of the assassination nine months ago of former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, which also came on a campaign tour and continues to reverberate in Japanese politics. Kishida resumed election, campaigning on Saturday afternoon after a smoke bomb was allegedly thrown at an event he attended in central Japan, weeks before he hosts the group of seven world leaders for a summit. Chief Cabinet Secretary Hirokazu Matsuno stated that police were looking into the motive and background of the suspected perpetrator. He added, that he had instructed them to be thorough in protecting VIPs ahead of the summit. え、被疑者の人定動機背景等について Security had already been a high priority for the G7 summit, set for May 19th to 21st, following the shock of last year's assassination. G7 ministers are also having meetings on the northern island of Hokkaido and in the resort town of Karuizawa this weekend.